Welcome everyone to the wedding ceremony of Will and Leah. We have gathered this evening, or I should say this afternoon as well, to celebrate the coming together of two lives. Leah and Will, who have grown in love, have made the life-changing decision to become husband and wife. They are surrounded today by family and friends who represent the community who loves them, has nurtured them over the years. Each of you specifically selected based on your relationship to Leah and Will. As such, everyone present today has an essential role in this marriage. First, you're essential for creating the temporary space that's sacred for the ceremony. Your presence is needed to make this space holy and sacred for the next several minutes. All of you specifically invited to be witnesses to the affirmations of Leah and Will, which we'll hear shortly. Found my truth and I made my way. I was much too used to being so afraid. Didn't recognize my own desire till I saw your face. Known the people present today for many years. You're the ones who have supported them, developed the relationships with them. So it's only fitting you're the ones to share this once in a lifetime moment with them. As such, each and every one of you will have an obligation to remain a part of their lives, to be supportive and nurturing the years to come. For this wedding, we're creating sacred space in this beautiful setting. Not only are we elevated in altitude, separating us from the routine of daily living, but the words, vows, and prayers that will be uttered today have a special path to the heavens. Once the bride and groom have stepped into the sacred space, they've entered a changed or altered state in which everything leading up to the wedding preparation magically melts away. And all that's left is the love that brought them to this moment. I wish for both of you that you may have many years together to be able to grow as individuals as you also develop as a couple, and that the love you have for each other only continue to deepen. May your marriage be a time of waking up each morning, falling back in love with each other every day for all the days of your life. Eight years ago, I was fresh to California and ready to put my head down and just get off to college. Then I met you, the love of my life. As we continue to grow in our lives together, I promise to encourage and support you in following your dreams. I promise to make you to laugh when times are hard, and I promise to cry with you when times are really hard. In the end, I promise that when we are old and gray, we will look back on our lives together and have no regrets. I love you. Will, of all the people you've met and of all the places you've been, somehow, in some way, you've ended up here with me. You have filled my life with joy, and from this day forward, my heart is entirely yours. I promise to always pursue you, to fight for you, and love you unconditionally for the rest of my life. I promise to choose you every day, not because I have to, but because I want to. I don't think I can love you any more than I do right now, but that's how I felt yesterday and the day before and every day for the last eight years. I can't wait for our future together, and I love you more. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've all been waiting for is my great honor and privilege by the power vested in me, and I have that power. I pronounce you now husband and wife. Well, you may now seal the deal with the kiss.
I'm smiling in the silence Wondering if you are even 